Good morning, good afternoon everybody. Um, so I've had some people wanting to, uh, me to do a video of the inside um, of the ship. Obviously I did a tour at the top, but I'm going to do a recorded version. So this is one of four dining rooms. Uh, this is American Icon uh, Dining Room. Um, you can see it's uh, pretty big. They're all about the same size, but there's four of them. Uh, so that's one. Over here, I'll take you through um, this is called uh, silk, <laughs> Thank you. silk, uh, which is more of a um, theming around, like, an Indian uh, or Asian fusion, I suppose you could say. But they're, but they're all the same meals now. Um, but yeah, so this is um, it goes down, down across there. So it's going to be a bit of a long video because I'm actually going to walk you through. Um, so this is one of the dining rooms, and there's another two down there which I'll show you uh, later on so I'm actually going to walk you guys back towards the 270 so we're at one end of the ship at the moment with the dining rooms and the kitchens and everything and this is um, above is where I did the video of all the flights of um, all the uh, lifts going up to all the 17 floors I think it's 15 floors actually um, okay so this bit here um, is known as the Royal Promenade. Um, so down here you have guest services. Uh, the casino is down there, which I can't record because it's uh, sea day and people are gambling. So this is the inside of um, the Royal Promenade. Um, you have retail shops either side, um, as well as cafes. So we've got the Lopetisserie, right now is a um, uh, some shopping going on, some Royal Caribbean products if they wanted. You've got the, the Cafe Promenade here, which is like a uh, Starbucks kind of thing, I suppose you could say. Um, you've also got La Patisserie over there, which is uh, cakes and coffee as well. Here you have Sorrento's Pizza. Sorrento's Pizza. Um, it's open till 3 in the morning and you've got the Amber and Oak pub uh, which I can go in you can see it's like a traditional kind of British pub uh, I've seen some better designs of this type of thing but it's oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, then you go around here and you have some more shops um, I'll take you upstairs in a moment so you've got more shots. Um, uh, so that's the other end of, of um, Amber and Oak. You have a Schwatsky. Um, some more retail throughout, throughout this section here. Prince and Green is basically just kind of lo local, kind of, um, I suppose you could say it has Aussie stuff in there. This bit here is known as the Music Hall. You would have seen some videos on here. So the Music Hall is a two level venue. Um, which basically, well, yeah, it's, it's like it's a nightclub kind of bar. So you got um, basically a big a stage there where people perform with the dance floor, um, and it's two floors. There's, there's seating underneath, as you can see, the same as that over there. Hi. <laughs> um, uh, the bar's not open at the moment. It is still before midday, so people. Um, or, yeah, and there's also some pool tables down there along the window, which they also tilt, so they they're always level. Okay, hi, oh, sorry, thank you very much. So taking you back out through here, um, so this then takes you back to towards the the, the back end of the ship. Oh, sorry, uh, then you've got sundials, which is uh, Royal Caribbean uh, uh, kind of like products. Um, and I don't know if it's going to be open. No, it's not. And back here, it's closed at the moment, is um, the, the Royal Theatre. So essentially we've gone from one end of the ship to the other. But I can't take you down because it's kind of closed at the moment. Okay, so if I take you back, I'm going to pause this bit and then I'll take you back to... Um, actually, no, we'll go this way, actually. We'll go... Um, so right now it's just gone 11 o'clock in the morning. 
everyone's had breakfast. Um, I've just been to guest services to sort out my bill. Um, okay, so if I go this way. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you up up these flights of stairs. If I go this way here, and um, so we're kind of going back on ourselves quickly. Uh, this bit here is uh, there's, a, there's a quiz going on here. This is a schooner bar. Schooner bar is another bar uh, which you'll play a play your piano normally of an evening. So the schooner bar. And I'll continue walking you this way. Um, and this place, this place here, the red. Walls is Izumi. Izumi is um, sushi. Um, we've never gone in there. It's, it's a pay for. You've got to pay for it. Um, so we've not gone. Now you would have seen. I've gone now. Gone upstairs. So we're back in the Royal Promenade, but we're now on a different deck. So just along here we have uh, the Robo um, bartenders. So literally during after midday, these come to life and. Um, basically create your drinks, a little bit of drinks go on this thing here, so you can see, I am, um, hey by the way, <laughs> um, they, you can see what's been ordered and these things shake away and make the drinks. Across the way there is um, Wonderland, which is like an Alice in Wonderland type of themed restaurant. And then short excursions, if you want to book a short excursion, you can use the iPads and book an extra short excursion. Um, and then that's back there where I took you guys yesterday, uh, part of it. I'll just quickly go out here because this looks absolutely stunning right now. So if I come through here. Well, so this kind of gives you a bit of a context of size. So these here are, are the lifeboats. You see the size of the person. They take about 300 people, I think. Um, it's a beautiful day today. Um, people are watching the um, watching the um, uh, scenery. We're currently going through some islands um, because one of us port days has been cancelled. Um, so okay, so this is where I did a video last time where you can see all the all the lifts. That bit, that bit there, by the way. Oh, that bit there. You can stand on that, that's glass, so you can actually stand above the, the actual shaft. Okay, and now here is what's known as the view. I think it's called the view. Um, it's just basically another section that there's nothing either side, I'm guessing, I don't know, kitchens or something, um, which then takes you to this bit here. We have Jamie's, um, Jamie Oliver's Italian restaurant here, followed by some more retail shops. These are really expensive, by the way, we'd never go in here very high end. Um, last night we met with some friends for drinks here at Vintage's Wine Bar. Um, you can get wine uh, by tap. I'll go through here. Uh, but you can also order drinks through these wine stations when it's when it's working. I'm not quite sure how it works. I think you just order it, you select select the wine that you want and I guess it comes out of this thing here. I've never done it because I don't drink wine. Um, this is one of probably, I don't know how many bars there are on this thingy, but there's definitely quite a few bars. Um, I'd say it's probably about 20. I don't know for sure. Um, and I'm going to take you down this way. Try and make sure it wraps up within 10 minutes video. <laughs> so, there's always plenty of stuff for you to eat. Um, and here we've got the 270 Cafe. So I'll take you into the 270 Cafe. Um, Basically, it's another kind of um, dining place. We're currently doing paninis. It's still breakfast, looks like. So you've got pastries, um, cereals, bagels, uh, coffee, which is Starbucks coffee, and a mixture of drinking stations and sauces and coffee from there. And then, looks like there's a competition going on in here, but this is the 270, which you would have seen me do before. That was number one. So 270 is a day and night venue. Right. 
Next tune, number two. I'm doing name the tune, but it's got two two tiers up there. And seating as well. So, so that's my little tricky tour around uh, the inside um, part of the ship. Um, this is spread across three decks. So three decks basically takes us um, from deck three to decks five and six, I think. So maybe it's four, I don't know, four decks. But yeah, so that's a little ticket tour. Um, thanks for joining me. And um, I hope this was really good for you to see. Thank you.